All right, guys, I got my second box order back, large order from PSA. I was tipped off to this first one. I wanted to make it a surprise, but as you can see, I am delighted. Uh, I got an SP Authentic Kobe and a 10. Uh, probably the year I act last, uh, the last year anyway, that I actively really collected even was 2001. Uh, in terms of like buying packs regularly. And uh, I looked through my old cards, I think like a lot of people did over the pandemic and uh, came across uh, this just in a, in a box, went through it, got it all sleeved up and we got a 10. So happy with that. Let's go to the next one here. Wow, a Nash. Bowman's best came in a gem. Two gems in a row. This is amazing, guys. Nash Bowman's best in a 10. And you see, I didn't even notice Iverson's on there, too. All right, let's see next one. Okay, I can live with a 9 on this one. Uh, coast to Coast Refractor Kobe in a 9. Very nice. Very nice. All right, next one. Uh, I like the Jordan bat, uh, baseball cards, so I uh, found uh, found this one and just going through my old cards when I was a kid, actually. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with a nine. That's pretty good. Oh, they're sticking together on me. <laughs> Here we go. Stadium Club Kobe and a nine. Rookies one. I think I had a couple rookies two in the other lot, but uh, I have to say, Stadium Club uh, really known for their quality photography, even today. A Z Force Kobe rookie in a nine. That's pretty solid. A Fleer Kobe rookie in a nine. Wow, I'm actually. I think I kind of lucked out. I thought that might be an eight. I will definitely take that. Oh, sticking together again. Oh, uh, UD3 Kobe even came in at a 9. I thought that was for sure an 8. Wow. Kind of lucking out here. All right, let's move on. UD3 and a 9 is pretty solid, though. Uh, pretty solid. Tops Gold Jordan and a 9. I bought a ton of this product back in the day because it, you could find it at Kmart back when they sold wax and they were even open for that matter. Uh, 36 pack boxes for $9.99. So as a kid, very affordable product and lucky enough to pull a gold, of, gold parallel of this Jordan card. Nice card. A Leaf Thomas came in at a nine. That's pretty good. Add that to my uh, Hall of Famers collection. Oh, I also sent in the Leaf Ripken, I guess. So I forgot. Cool, and that came in at a nine. This is a really good box so far, though I have to say. Uh, an SP Griffey came in, coming in at a nine. Not too bad. Pretty condition sensitive set. That was the A Rod year. Uh, okay, uh, Nash SP coming in at a nine. Pretty uh, tough grade. Uh, as I said in my other video, the corners are quite sensitive on this release. SP 96 basketball. Uh, okay, I was pretty happy with that. I thought that might, might be an eight, so happy with a nine. That was a pretty cool die cut card I uh, pulled way back in the day, around the time the product was even actually coming out. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of stunned. Uh, uh, the Power Boosters Jordan came in near Mint Mint 8. This, uh, I thought kind of had a rough corner. I was thinking this was going to be like a 6, so... Very happy with an eight there. Not too bad at all. Very tough insert to hit. Uh, 
the FLIR Metal, uh, the Fresh Foundation version. Uh, pretty cool, near mint mint eight. Draft day. Uh, I guess I sent in another Nash. This one came in at a nine. Uh, that's all right, not too bad. I think this is the last two, so let's see. Okay. Draft Redemption Nash, that's a pretty cool looking card there, Came in, coming in at a nine. Uh, got this for four bucks back at the card shop back in the day. I remember it had a sticker on it, $4 price sticker, so I'm happy with that purchase, to say the least. I think that's probably a few hundred, maybe a couple hundred at least. And then rounding it out with another, I guess I got doubles now, of the Hoops Rookie Gold. Uh, coming in at eight again. So overall, pretty solid lot. Uh, good amount of tens, mostly nines, uh, nothing less than an eight. So you got to be happy with that. Uh, pretty solid box so far. I'll be back to you with the next one. A lot of Jordans to come still, guys.